Hi there. Welcome to Titing 101. Siki first. Two men crash a plane on a deserted island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean. They both survive the crash. Then just after their terrible ordeal, one of the men walks all over the entire island and comes to the conclusion that there is no food or fresh water. He goes back to where his friend is to explain their predicament. I've searched this entire island and haven't found any food or water. We're going to die. The other man says, Don't worry, I make $100,000 a week. We'll be fine. Yes, but don't you see? There's no... There's nothing to eat, and without water, we're doomed. Like I said, I make a hundred grand each week. Don't worry, we'll be home in a day or two. Why do you keep saying that? How is your money going to help us a way out here, bro? As the other guy sits there, Leaning back against the smashed plane, he says with a smile, You see, every Sunday at church, I put my tithe of 10% from the 100,000 in the offering plate, like the good book instructs. And my pastor will find me. You'll see. <laughs> in Malachi 3.10-12, to 12, Bring the full tent into the storehouse so that there may be food in my house. Test me in this way, says the Lord of armies. See if I will not open the floodgates of heaven and pour out the blessing for you without measure. There is something so supernatural about tithing that everyone in the old and contemporary history who operated the principles of tithing, were always serially blessed. Hashtag blessed ikanga. No matter the argument against tithing, tithing is part of our spiritual worship and biblical obligation and stewardship. Tip, theory and practice. In Malachi 3, verses 10 to 12, Particularly in verse 10, it says, Bring the full tent. Bring the full tent. The challenge is, You bring everything to me. Seek me first. In Matthew 6.33, it says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and His righteousness and all the things that you can imagine will be added unto you. Bring the full, the full tent. The Lord wants you to test Him. You see, nothing is happening because you're not testing Him. We challenge you. Test the Lord. Seek Him first. Seek His glory. You know, everything is given to you by God. He just want back the 10% because He doesn't need it. He just want to bless you. He wants you to develop that Character of obedience. Again, seek ye first the kingdom of God and His righteousness. Let's give. God bless you.